Hi friends, it's me, Miss Sharon, and I'm here today to, drum roll, read another book. That's right. Okay, well, let's see. This book is called Hungry Bird by Jeremy Tankard. Hungry? Oh, I think I'm getting hungry right now. I think I might want a snack. Oh, did you hear that? That was my stomach rumbling. That loud noise that your stomach makes when it's hungry, that's called rumbling. And that might be a word you might hear today in this book. Hmm, I don't know, we'll see. Okay, you ready? Let's get started. All right, my friends, Hungry Bird by Jeremy Tankard. Hungry Bird by Jeremy Tankard. Bird and his friends had just set out on a hike when Bird's tummy rumbled. I'm getting hungry, said Bird. I might need something to eat. The other animals didn't answer. They were too busy enjoying the hike. Hey, Fox, said Bird. Did you pack anything for me to eat? I'm a bit pickish. I brought some yummy berries. Would you like a few? No, thanks, said Bird. Berries are not my favorite. Suit yourself, said Fox. Bird's tummy rumbled louder. Oh, my tummy. Hey, beaver, said Bird. Have you brought anything delicious to eat? I'm hungry. I have lots of nice crunchy sticks, said Beaver. Would you like some? Sticks? Ugh, said Bird. Are you crazy? Birds don't eat sticks. Well, beaver stew, yum, said beaver. Bird's legs were growing weak. Oh, hey sheep, said Bird. Have you packed anything tasty? I'm starving. I packed some delicious grass, said sheep. We could share it. Grass? said Bird. I think you mean gross. Who wants to eat grass? I do, said Sheep. It's scrumptious. Bird could not go one more step. Hey, raccoon, said Bird. Please tell me you've remembered what I like to eat. I'm ravenous. I have this nice sandwich, said Raccoon. Would you like half? Sandwich, said Bird. Yuck, that's disgusting. It isn't, said Raccoon. It's a medley of flavors. Bird was sure he was going to pass out from hunger. Hey, rabbit, shouted Bird. Give me something to eat now. How about carrots, said Rabbit. Carrots are delicious. Carrots are orange, shouted Bird. How on earth can I eat carrots? You crunch it. Like said Rabbit, like this. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Bird's tummy roared and he collapsed to the ground. He lay where he had fallen. He lay there some more. You mean none of you packed me a snack that I like? Bird called to his friends. If I don't eat this very instant, I might die. 
Bart's friends had stopped to rest on a log and eat their snacks. They called to him. Bert could hardly hear them over his noisy stomach. Be quiet, Tommy, whimpered Bert. I'm starving to death here. Bert looked at his friends happily munching away. He was too hungry to walk. He crawled over to them. Okay, fine. I'll try your snacks, said Bert. He tasted some berries. Mm. These taste very round. He nibbled on some sticks. Crunchy. He chewed some grass. I feel like a sheep. Bert tried the sandwich. It's not as disgusting as I thought. He even ate a carrot. Hmm, not bad. It does taste orange, but I like it. Just then, Fox spotted something wiggling in the grass. Bird, he said, your favorite snack, a worm. No thanks, said Bird, I'm thirsty. Who brought me a drink? D and I hope you friends love this book. I like, it. it's kind of funny. All right, my friends, we'll see you next time. Bye.